Okay, so today we're gonna to be learning how to use the Content Aware Fill tool in Adobe Photoshop CC 2019. To do this, you need to have updated to Adobe Photoshop CC 2019 because the upgraded Content Aware Fill tool wasn't in 2018 or 2017. What you wanna start by doing is pressing L on your keyboard, which brings up the lasso tool and start by selecting the subject that you want to get rid of. So let's, let's just do a quick selection around him. Doesn't have to be very precise. And go up to your edit menu and then go down below fill to content aware fill. What this will bring up is a window that looks like this. And what basically it is, is this is where you edit it. And this is your preview of what it will look like. So to explain it simply, anything that's in this green square is what can be placed into the, this selection here. So what you start by doing is making sure that you have the sampling brush tool selected. If you don't press B and what you do is you can just click and drag and select the things that you don't think should be in the, in the photo. So what you do is stuff like the trees, but still keeping some of those logs there. And that looks pretty good. Click OK. What you want to do is to deselect, you do Control D and that deselects it. And for this next step, you can obviously see there's a big black dot there that's anyone will see and go, what, what's that? So what I just do is do a quick clone stamp. You can press S on your keyboard and grabbing that by pressing Alt, clicking, and then pasting it over. And now I think that looks good for the first part. Okay, so for the next subject you wanna get rid of, what you wanna do firstly is create a new layer and press Control, Alt, Shift, and E. That pastes everything from these layers onto one layer so you can deselect those. What you wanna do is once again, press L on your keyboard draw a quick selection around your subject there now go up to edit content away fill and again deselect the parts you don't want to include you can always see that photoshop already did a very good job at cleaning up this area but you can obviously see in this little area here that it's copied some of the poles, which you don't need. So you can mainly get rid of this side because that's you don't really need that. Now you want to get rid of some of the poles. I think that looks good. So you also want to get rid of some of this excess ground just because it's not you don't really need it. And once you're happy with it, as you can see, it looks pretty good. Just click OK. And as you can see here, once again, press Control D. If I zoom in over here by pressing Z and then clicking, you can see it's cleaned it up quite well. And I, I don't think it's a big problem that this tree is doubled because I don't think anyone will notice because not usually people are zooming in on photos and nitpicking about a tree being duplicated. So after that, there's nothing really much else to do. You can take a look at your photo, make a couple of edits, do all that stuff. You can once again, press Alt, Control, Shift, E to compress all the layers onto one layer. And now you can see the before and the after. Thanks for watching. Be sure to let me know in the comments if you want me to do any other tutorials on Photoshop or Lightroom. 